G'day guys, it's Honsu again from Tackle West. Um, today we're just going to do a basic rundown on uh, reel maintenance, uh, particularly what do you do after you rinse off your reels. More commonly used reels will be your spin reels, particularly like you know something from that size or that size, or even your little light brim ones. Um, obviously, rinse your reels down. Try to hose them down like gently, with light, light water pressure, because you know if you rinse it down with high pressure, obviously it's going to push all the salt water back into the reel or, or further into the reel. Probably the best way to rinse it off is to use uh, warm water where you can, or even a bucket of um, soapy water, just sponge it off. That will more likely to get more salt off than just rinsing with just like top cold water hose. The yeah, same thing with most reels, once you've done that, just back the drag off, let it air dry. Now, what to do after the reels all dried up? Once it's all air dry and you're not planning to use it for quite a while, um, there is like you know, quite a number of like, you know, basic maintenance you can do to keep your reel in really good condition um, as well as your line in good condition as well uh, we recommend these products here Ballistol, it's a good um, basically a biodegradable product you can use it on um, basically on, on any surfaces all right help lubricate the reels and also like, help dissolve part of the salt off but just stops the corrosion from going too far so use on all the nooks and crannies that you can't get to when you're rinsing your reel so particularly like gaps where your body is or um, or even the screw holes you know on the salt take out of that where there's a lot of like, gaps where the salt water's going to sit in spray into that liberally and just wipe it off all the excess then let it basically yeah work, do its job so the other thing that this thing does is basically leaves a coating on there again to minimize corrosion by having a coating on there it stops the, the corrosion oxidizing with the air so so yeah so another product that we commonly use as well, um, it's um, these two product here from Varavas. One of them is a, um, uh, they, they call it knee shoe. It's all it is, it's a, um, it's a salt water solvent. So same, if you can't, if you can't use hot, got hot water and you just want to get quick rinse, this will help get rid of the rest of the salt. It basically spread liberally all around your reel, particularly anywhere where there's got little small holes, um, on spin reels, particularly around the star drag itself, there was gaps there. That's more likely to get corrosion, even around the foot, because they're riveted on. So you don't want the salt water to be trapped in there and corroding away. So by spraying this all around it, and from the back, from the front, and just basically once you've done that, just let it air dry. The second product they do here, it's called PE conditioner. You've probably seen it on our on our website and videos that we basically harping on about it, but it is a damn good product because there's no other product like it and it actually works so what it is it's a braid conditioner or they call it PE conditioner it helps clean the, the salt off your braid um, dissolves all the, the salt out of the fibers and also um, creates a new um, a silicon coating on the braid so it keeps it all nice and slick and soft so yeah so that way your braid will last a lot longer and uh, lastly, um, to overheads, particularly large overheads like those game reels or the electric reels, definitely you just use a sponge, hot water sponge, just sponge it off. Um, same thing again, if you can't get hold of a hot water or some warm water, rinse it off as best as you can. And then any nooks and crannies, I'll go back to my ballista and just sprays around, you know, anywhere where it's going to likely to collect salt, like all the screw holes here, any cavities in here, um, even, believe it or not, even under the clicker here, because salt water is going to get trapped in the hole and go down. It's basically anywhere where you're likely, it's got likely going to get salt trapped in there. Um, same goes with the electric reel. Now most electric reels have a, like a plastic cover around them with a metal frame. So the metal frame is what you want to concentrate more on, which is the black part here. So spray into here, around the four rivets here. And the other thing is like in this part here, where the power cord's connected to, obviously it's brand new reel will have grease in there. Same thing, the grease will basically stop it from corrosion. So if you find the grease is a bit light on, you can basically use grease from a dial like this one here, or even just a general purpose light duty grease and just use a little just a little brush, just brush it on, just smear it all in there, get it on in there. So that way the salt water won't penetrate that because all it is, it's a very light alloy um, tubing there. But obviously you can use these two grease here for any general maintenance you want to feel free to do it yourself. Um, particularly if you want to do your own spin reels take the handle off and take the spool off so 
You can either oil this part here or oil the bearings if there's any bearings on the spool support. Another basic part there, if you've got any oils as well, take the line roller off. Now the line roller needs to turn all the time, so a bit of oil into the bearing or the shaft. And then once you put it back to go the last bit to, before you put back onto the bar arm itself, is to apply a layer of grease over the, bar, the line roller and the bearing and then put it back in there. That will basically create like a, like a surface in there with the grease keep, to keep water out. If you find you're, you're, if you find you want to ask more questions or anything you want to know about this um, general maintenance, feel free to contact us on Tackle West on our Facebook message on Facebook page or call us on 9350-6278 and ask whatever question you like on real maintenance. Right guys, if you want your reels done um, serviced here at Tackle West, bring it to us. We do top quality, professional and fast reel servicing here. And we do all sorts of reel servicing from spin reels to overheads to game reels to even electric reels, especially um, Daiwa Soltegas or any Daiwa reels with mag seal oils, we do them as well. And we're doing quick.